right, let's stir things up a bit here. Um, I've seen a lot, a lot of videos where people mix their concoctions for their feeding, their fertilizer and everything. So I thought, why not try my own? Because I have a high respect for people that do it on camera because you never really know what's coming out. Especially in my case, I never really know because out here, it's a different ball game compared to what I mix in the kitchen. I'm pretty safe with that. Here, I never really know. This is my Vanda tub, and it's time to add all the components into this water. Last night, I put in a good portion of the MSU fertilizer so that it would be all diluted and everything for this morning. And over here, I have um, magnesium, Epsom salts, soaked overnight, so that's all diluted, and calcium nitrate, pH down. So these, this now, I have no idea what the TDS is in here, because I normally don't start with MSU, I start with the calcium nitrate. Because it gives me a better idea of how much I need to add. Oh, that's all right. That's all right. 180 of MSU. Okay, perfect. Because I normally do go with 200. So I'm going to stick with the 180. And then I have no idea about my calcium nitrate stock solution either. But I want. If I have 180, I want to get to 280. So I want in here calcium nitrate up to 240, 260. So we'll try that first. And then see if we've got it right. Because when I do my calcium nitrate to dissolve it for this, exercise I don't measure either I just chuck in a lot of kernels and with a lot of water and then I use up whatever solution I have left for the daily fertilizing so I want to get to 260 and you can see it's 199 boy that was a weak solution that I made last night so we can be a little bit more generous And let's have a look. Keep going. All right. That's Thierry Henry. 226, 25. I am not going to get to 260. It was way too timid last night. I'm not going to get to 260. So, I'll be back. I have to mix up a little bit more calcium nitrate. We're back. Luckily, calcium nitrate doesn't take long to dissolve. So let's just double check again. I think I was at 219, 220. Oh, look, 225. 225. Okay, let's see what concentration I put in here. Still want 240. If it goes a little bit over, normally I'm not bothered. We're dealing with Anders here and they. They can do with more calcium. So I'm not too concerned. But you know, give it a rough, give it a as best an estimate as possible. Switch that thing off again. Switch it on. Let's go. 260, 259. Whoop. There we go. I'll take that. 
Yeah, I'll take that. So, let me now add in, get this to 300 with magnesium. And again, my solution is never, I can't calculate with what I mix up at night. I just mix up enough and then play it, play around with it. I'd like to go up to 400, but I'm not going to go there today if I can't make it 400 this time around with my MSU. Look at that. 287. If I can't get it to 400 with my MSU with the amount I put in, that's fine as well. We can add a little bit more magnesium. There we go. It would be the first time that I emptied the magnesium solution I prepared the night before. From a calculation point of view, it would be the first time. I do this about, in the summer, I have to change this water once a week. In the winter, every three weeks. The algae buildup gets too much, as you saw on my Vander roots. Here we are, 300. I can't believe it. <laughs> Trust me, this doesn't happen when I do this on a weekly basis. This is a first to have my magnesium solution so well dosaged. Now, let me check what the pH says. Okay, that's a bit, too, that's way too high. Obviously. I want to get it down to 5.8 and there's only one problem if one wants to call it a problem this pH solution that I have this time around is not as strong as what I had before which is a bummer because I need a lot more of it but then again I went for the cheaper brand this time <coughs> pH down <clears throat> equates pH down in my books, but no, canna, I, it took me two years to go through my canna, let's see, what do we got, five points, I can't believe it, you guys, I should film this more often, I'm usually faffing around here, like at least 20, 30 minutes to get it right, sometimes I have to bring bicarbonate of soda out, but look at this, 5.8 <laughs> well the video gods have blessed me because I thought this would be a long video <laughs> with a lot of editing but no 5.83 that is perfect so that is how I mix up my under top well that worked out well so now they can enjoy their soak. That's the band is taken care of. Now to go and feed the zoo. Have a great day, everybody. Take care. Be safe. Bye.